Well, it's part of the world where more people live uh, to be a hundred than anywhere else, and they're living active lives as well. So what's the secret on the Japanese island of Okinawa? CNN's Kyung Law went to find out. Amid the tall citrus trees of Okinawa, Japan, Suni Ganaha is busy picking fruit as she does eight hours every day. It's not what she does, but who she is that's remarkable. I just turned 90, she says. Age 90. Climbing tree after tree, hauling down bags of fruit, and doesn't remember a day she's ever been sick in her nearly 70 years on this farm. Ganaha's 54 and 61 year old daughters say good luck trying to get her to retire. We can't stop her, they say. And why would they? She's the best climber in the family. Ganaha is just one of many very active seniors in their 90s and 100s in the town of Ogimi, defying the physical odds of age. Here they run, they dance. In a culture where Alzheimer's, cancer, and heart disease is unheard of among these elders. We met 96-year-old Toyohide Taira, who loves to flirt with the ladies, who tells young people, don't get married, you'll be sick of your spouse when you're 90. If you're looking for a place that has that right mix of factors, then you've come to the right place. Gerontologist Craig Wilcox has been studying longevity in Okinawa for 15 years, an island that has the highest percentage of centenarians anywhere in the world. He points to a number of factors. The Okinawan diet, very low in fat, salt and sugar. This traditional lunch plate is filled with papaya, tofu and dark leafy vegetables. At this weekend event, they snack on citrus fruits and sip unsweetened green tea. They exercise and work well into old age. There's a good, affordable health care system that focuses on prevention and a strong sense of community that values optimism. Where older people remain active and respected, Wilcox says any community can replicate this. We still refer to these types of diseases as age-associated disease back in North America. Well, People don't do that anymore here. There's tremendous amount of control that people have over these diseases if they live the right lifestyle. Mm. And just like this? Hi. So you eat this as you're working? Hi, hi. Suni Ganaha's family swears by a daily dose of Okinawan citrus. It's sour. But more importantly, working and being close to family. A recipe she says will keep her hiking these hills for more years to come. Kyung Law, CNN, Okinawa, Japan.